My news doesn't leave this room. Once the world learns of my illness, our enemies will move in. Try to take advantage of France's weakness. We must prepare for the transition of power as a family and in secret. Does Mother know? Catherine no longer has the privilege of contact with her children. She wouldn't be of any comfort to me either. But you're dying, and she's your mother. No, I've recognized John, given him lands and titles, but he'll never be king. When Lola learns of my fate, she will fear for him. You understand the life of a bastard son. John will be protected. I promise. Now you see why we had to send for you. I should have studied. Actually, listen, as my guardians blathered on about tithes and land reforms. You were right. I never thought it. Give us some time. I have decided that after my passing, you will take Mary as your wife. But she loves you. When the time comes, I want my own wife, someone my own age. Now you know that that is not always possible. Our own marriage was arranged to bring our two countries together. What has Scotland ever done for France? Charles, this marriage would not only benefit Mary. A young king needs a regent. And we can't trust anyone with that amount of power. Usurpers would come after your crown. If I'm to be married. Married to a queen, you won't need a regent. Mary is an experienced ruler who would ensure a smooth transition of power. I want to know what Mother thinks. I told you before, Mother's opinion doesn't matter. Not anymore. Well, she knows more about political strategy than anyone. How could her opinion not matter? You don't understand who she is. The real Catherine. Then make me understand. I don't even know why she's locked up. So she went to England. Is that a crime? Why don't you just tell me? Fine. You two can hate her for whatever it is she did, but she's still my mother. And I am still your king. For today. But if I'm to wed Mary, you must die. And when that happens, I will be king. I don't want to get married. And I don't have to. No one can know the specifics of my mother's crimes. Kidnapping my son, fleeing to England to marry off my brother to our greatest rival. And if Charles, if anyone found out that you tried to smear your name. By telling the truth, Francis, my indiscretion with Conrad. Truth became treason when she took it to the Vatican. And that serious charge in the hands of my mother's enemies. They'd call for her execution. We need Charles's cooperation, but if he demands to see her. Catherine will scheme and plot until the day she dies. Every time someone takes a tray of food to that cell, there is a chance she will bend them to her will. Use that opportunity to hatch her revenge. And after you are gone... Charles will have the power to see her anyway. He will come from Catherine, having heard her plea that she was doing everything for the good of France. We can tell him our side too, and be sure he doesn't share it. Francis. Your brother isn't asking for audience with Catherine as the future king. He's a terrified boy who needs the love of his mother. Let Catherine comfort her son. Are you all right? Let me speak to her first. <laughs>